Told you it wouldn't be long. Shit, stream's over. It runs away. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Magic Carp is an app. Yes. It's actually a game called... Um, it's called Magic Carp Jump. It was a goofy game that I did play. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, guys. Um, ooh. I don't need to have the... Uh, I don't need to have the uh, Twitch open anymore. Can somebody say something now so that I know that it's working though? Thing now. Because I'm switching over from one window to another and... Okay, thank you, Al. All right, so I can close this now. I just wanna make sure that as I close the chat, I'm not missing anything. So we're gonna, we're gonna start the intro movie, which by the way, I played the intro movie like three times yesterday and none of y'all told me that the sound was fucked up. I fixed that issue. So we're going to play the intro movie and then we're going to get on this. Hey, Wayne. I don't care. Yeah, it was really I'm echoey. Are, I'm going to kick you in the head repeatedly. Ah, brutality. I didn't even know I could do that shit. That was awesome. Get Compare the fucked. VODs. Like, compare the, the VOD of the last one. Oh, that's what I called it? Movie. Shit, I'm funny. After she ate the pitchfork, she ate, like, three tons of beans. And then as she was standing here, she blew it out her ass. He's not even a weenie. He's a full wiener. Like, a weenie is, like, wiener in training. But he's a full wiener. She do be whack. The Kipsy Noodle. Poop me an egg barrel. Poop me an egg barrel. I never thought I'd hear that or read it. Well, I heard it because I said it. I read it and I said it and I heard it. Even because uh, the way I'm doing it, I can't ah, your mother. Why Just seeing that bubble bobble. When I knew he was gonna do that shit. Drink the Kool Aid. Cracks me up. That is legit a Chozo statue. It's it's a Cholo statue. It would be like. Uh, a goose walked up to a lemonade stand, and he said to the man running the stand, uh, 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 and then the guy died. Ball farts is the insult reserved for dong lords, but only the biggest dong lords are ball farts. Like all dong lords are, all ball farts are dong lords, but not all dong lords are ball farts. If that makes any kind of sense to you, then you're you're crazy. Your mom is covered in white sauce and has a crispy bottom. Okay, just show me what it looks like. I will smash you like a clam on my... Bro. Let's do this. Okay, so... Why am I not seeing the game? Hold on a second, guys. Are you guys able to see the game or not? Uh, oh, there it goes. Okay. It just took a second to to be live. All right, let me unmute it as well. Oh, it's loud. Let me lower the volume on my end. Let me know how the game audio is on your end, guys. All right. So this is Ultima Runes of Virtue, which is a, there's actually a second one that I've never played. Maybe one day I'll do that. But uh, yes, it is ball farts. It was ball farts, Terry. Um, so, you know, Ultimate was a series that was made for PC, but there were a bunch of ports for, like, NES and Master System, Super Nintendo. Um, this was a game that was made for the Game Boy. It was not made as a PC game that was then dumbed down. This was made to be a, a Game Boy game. And it's actually super fun. It's A lot of Ultima fans didn't care for it because it's not at all like Ultima. It's more of like a like a total spin-off but it is so fun so let's see so we got mariah iolo um dupre and shimino i think we're gonna i usually you know i've actually done it with all four characters but i think um no, the super nes version was was part two and it was only in like japan oh i want to i'm gonna do shimino because i think he's the most balanced um just ass i mean, we're, we're, we're good with ass right what what no no 
ar ar ara asa we'll just do ass <laughs> there yep there's the clip Tar tardy fast chuff doggo okay i guess we'll play in medium Tis a dark time in the realm of Britannia. The Black Knight has stolen the eight runes of virtue from the castle of Lord British. As the boldest adventurer in the land, it is your quest to recover them. Yeah, Dr. Cat was actually, uh, was one of the developers. Screen's frozen? Hold on. Oh shit, it is. Uh, wow, okay. Let me see if I can fix that. Okay, that seemed to, all I did was like hide it and unhide it. Let me, got, the scene has been acting funky. Let me know if it does that again, okay? So I have an ax, all right. If it freezes again, let me know, because I think it has to do with it loading. Oh, yeah, yeah, um, don't listen to stuffy old Lord British. You can go to any cavern you want. Seek thou the rune of compassion in the cavern of hatred due north of here. Speak with me again on thy return. Okay, cool. Let's look around though, because the, the, the charm of this game is the hilarity of the, the weird shit the NPCs say and whatnot. You can shoot webs to get rid of them. For tough ones, you need the wand of fireballs. Sherry was also developed. All the characters in this game were developers that worked on the Ultima series. Secret doors look almost the same as walls. Oh, mouse. Not that I needed that, but that's an example of a secret. Yeah. Ah, chuckles before he put on some boxing gloves and went mad clown. There you go. That's super punch out, right, Chris? Let's go in there. God, this game is janky as fuck, but I love it. it it's a game from my childhood, and I was not a huge Ultima fan, but um, my uncle was, and he got me this game at one point, and. It's it's a really fun game. Can I look? Uh, there's there's the world map. So exciting. Get out of my way, clown. Richard Garriott, who was the creator of Ultima, actually oh, out of my way, you stupid. Oh god, no. He's he's walking down there. At least he didn't become Kefka. Chuckles, you piece of shit. There we go. Let's go in here. Star Tropics. We're going to be continuing that. Yeah. Here's new new. Hi there, I'll race you to my other shop. Last one there is a rotten egg. Yeah, no, I'm good on that. So you can buy, that's hearts. I believe that's food. And that's magic. Ultima one's very primitive. I mean, yeah, all the old Ultima games. All the Ultima games are pretty primitive, really. I think this is this other thing, or, yeah. Hi there, check out all the nifty stuff I'm selling. I'm saving up for a pet dragon. Pet derg. It says daggers, swords, um, armor, and a bow. I only have 30, so let's get a sword. So now I can I can do the stab. Stab. Dick Garriott. Yeah, but Richard Garriott actually said that this was his favorite console, or well, handheld, but still his favorite, like, non-PC Ultima game. And it's like, um... You know, it, it's interesting because it, it was not a port, and I think that's what makes it good. The Cavern of Hatred. I love this animation. It's so, like, not good, but I love it anyway. All right, let's see. These bats are pretty harmless. All right. Yeah, it's a cute game, and you would, you would, honestly, you would like this. Hmm. Oh, those mice always hit me. Like I know you're not an Ultima fan, but this is it, it, this is such like an anti-Ultima game. Uh, there's a skeleton over there. Let's take care of this guy. All right, clearly I gotta go that way. Yeah, I know that you hate the franchise, but I like if there's any Ultima game that you would like, it's this one. Because like I said, it's such an anti-Ultima game. Gotcha, bitch. Money, money. Thing in here? I didn't really need that. Life's too short. Oh, this is also a really short game. So there you go. But you know what? You don't have to play it because you're watching me stream it. That's real. I like the music too. Listen to that shit. Here's Sherry. Pick the mushroom and you can watch the monsters fight. I hope the trolls win this time. I don't think there's a point to this, but you can watch trolls fight wizards here. 
It's just... I think the purpose of that is just to show that the mushrooms can make things happen. They're kind of like switches. Oh, Sherry, I think the wizards are going to win. Yeah, wizards win. Asshole. Get back here. Uh, let's see. Donk, donk, donk. Donk, donk, donk. Donk, 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 donk. Okay, alright. Alright, let's go this way. Money. I think that's all I can get there. Well, games can be influential and great while not necessarily holding up all that well. Uh, okay. Let's go this way, then. I mean, I actually have... Because um, AJ actually wanted me to play Ultima. This was his idea, but... He was talking about, hey, I wanted to be doing one of the old Ultima games. And I said, well, I don't really want to because the only two Ultima games that I really would want to do, I've already recorded Let's Plays of them for um, for YouTube. But then there was, there was this one, and I'm like, I could do the Game Boy game. That's really fun. Yeah, sorry. I, I, I still screw up on it. They. Money. Uh, let's see what's here. Oh, heart key. All right. One door leads to a beautiful lady, the other a fierce tiger. I wish I could remember which is which. <sighs> I'll try this one. Oh, that's the lady. All right, hey. You have chosen well, and the next room is your reward. Because I'm like, I don't feel like fighting a tiger right now. Tigers are really tough enemies. Okay. Ah! Okay. Uh, yeah, this way. There's a reaper there. What hit me? Oh, the bat. I really don't want to deal with that Reaper. It was a really in-depth shareware Ultima clone. I've never, I've never even heard of it, to be honest. A sign, the arena. Pick the mushroom if you would do battle. The victor will be rewarded with precious gems. Delicious gems. Look around. All right. I used to have this game like fucking memorized, but oh god, the mouse got me. That, did the mouse just, like, fucking blow up for no reason? Alright. Reapers are tough, but... We can just do it like this. Dude, AJ, you should tell uh, tell everybody about that guy on the forum that you used to go to that was, like, basically a big Ultima fanboy and the way I trolled him. It was Gold Moon Dawn, yeah. Suicide Bomber Mice, the game's got everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. But but tell them about how I... About what I did. Okay. Do I want to go that way? Or, oh, God. Okay. There's a Reaper there. Stupid Reaper. I don't know why they're called Reapers when they're just like trees. Pretty common enemy in Ultima games, though. And we have screenshots of everything that AJ's talking about right now. Uh, hmm. I'll take that, but... Oh, no! Okay, well, I'll have to go back around. Yeah, and he was... He had a big, like, jerk-off to Ultima Online, right? They should have called them Tree Ants. Yeah, that would have made sense, right? No, I don't think they're in the same... I don't think that's what the person was getting at. Like, basically, um... I think the issue was that this person just wanted to always talk about Ultima at all times. And didn't really... I don't need to go that way. Alright. Didn't really respect any other games. There's Dr. Cat. Welcome to the boulder factory. Fill all the gaps with boulders, then pull the presto. Change the lever for your reward. Uh, okay, so... Let's see. The great presto change o lever. Like that James Bond guy. <laughs> ah. I 
Okay. I'm unsure if exactly... Oh, the gaps! Right, okay, 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 okay. I remember now. No, there's never a time when you need a gatekeeper around. So, yeah. But, but get to the, the point, AJ, about when I epically trolled this person. Oh, that's that's not good, actually. Let's do like this. All right. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Like, I was literally about to do that. Well, do it. Do it. Because the guy was going on about Ultima Online being like the <laughs> first MMO. All right, so then I... Hey, Wayne! Hit that. Is this a Metroidvania? No, it's a roguelike. There's the star key. Alright. <laughs> Gatekeepers trying to enjoy... Uh, stop, keep people from enjoying things. Sounds like a damn screen door in a submarine. Yep. Oh, what the... Well, I don't really need it, but... Nor do I need that heart. Ah! I forgot that sometimes those have enemies in them. Alright, well, hold on. What's here? Money! Oh, but you're... You're skipping ahead. You're... You're you're, you're talking about how I... Photoshop... I didn't really Photoshop the dick in Richard Garriott's mouth, by the way. But you're skipping the reasons why it came to that. Alright, now I can go here. Okay. Oh, you stupid mouse. Oh my god, I'm getting my ass kicked by mice. All right, there's a troll. You don't. You can't kill the troll here because it's opening and closing the shutters. I'll take that. Oh, I don't have a. Uh, I had a heart key. Now I don't. Okay, I'll tell the story because AJ is not remembering too well. So basically, uh, the guy was. I'm gonna die. Oh my god. I, I really wouldn't like to not die. The guy said that. Ultima Online was the first MMO, MMORPG, which is just not true. You know what I mean? Like, I get you're a big Ultima fan and everything. That's that's cool, but that's just not true. Oh fuck. Uh, yeah, we'll continue. I guess. Uh, no, I. I pressed the wrong button, and now the game's like I, I didn't get very far, but. This actually, it, it's frozen. I, I gotta fix. It's sort of. Well, the music's not playing. Give me a second here. Pro tip: Don't die. There we go. All right, go back in there. Cabin of hatred. Sorry about that, guys. So anyway, um, I came in, and, and basically this guy was not only talking about how. Um, actually, there's like some money and stuff I can grab. I forgot this game can be kind of tough. Not only was Ultima Online the first RPG, MMORPG, but he was being really insufferable about it. Like, the guy was being a huge dickbag and basically treating anybody who tried to tell him otherwise as, oh, well, you're just a huge idiot, you know? And I came in there with my, you know, I had like a, like a not a real account. Like, it wasn't Necro VMX, it was called like Laffy Taffy 420 or something like that. Like, it was this goofball account I made to troll people on this forum because I didn't care about them or anybody. And uh, the only person I cared about on this forum was, was AJ. So AJ told me about this guy and had me look at it. And I was like, wow, all right, this guy deserves, he deserves the Laffy Taffy treatment. So I was going to go in there and taff it up in the Laffy house, you know? So I fucking, um... Uh, is Through the Looking Glass was the name of the four. I didn't really need to talk to you, Melissa. TTLG. So I had this troll account that I used, and I had, I'm a, I'm a troll this guy, you know? And basically, uh, you know, I came in and I told him that, you know, that he's basically wrong about everything that he said, and that Ultima online was not the first MMO and, you know, I talked about like Asheron's Call or whatever it is that actually came first. Uh, I don't really want to do that. And, you know, 
And he was like, oh, it takes so much effort to look stuff up on Wikipedia. And I'm just like, fuck you, dude. You're not even right, though. Like, yeah, like, anybody can look up on Wikipedia that you're wrong. And, you know. And he basically still, like, even though he had been proven wrong, still tried to make it, like, um, that he was the one who was the smartest in the room, you know? So anyway, uh, <laughs> I fucking... You know, basically called the guy out for basically being in love with the Ultima series. And how he just, you know, had like this slobbering cock lust for Richard Garriott. And, you know, I was being a dick, obviously. But, um, he kept, see, because like I said that, you know, I think it was Ashron's call. I said that, uh, <laughs> Moogle, my, uh, Ultima Online is the first time MMORPG. My brother has an out-of-print book that mentions it. There's the proof. Yeah. I didn't actually mean to talk to Dr. Cat there. So anyway, I, I, you know, I proved that there were MMOs before it, you know? And he says, well, it's not, that was an online RPG and it was multiplayer, but it wasn't massive. And I'm like, you motherfucker, the term MMO literally was a thing before Ultima Online. Like, they didn't come up with the term MMO specifically to describe Ultima Online, which is basically what he was saying. Oh, wrong thing. He moved the goalposts, exactly. So I was just, like, really just annoyed with this guy because, like, even when he was proven wrong, he still felt like he had to be right. Oh, that's not the one, but I'll take it. I think it's this one, actually. Yep. So anyway, I, um... And he kept saying, like... Oh, I don't have a star key. Shit. All right, go back. Maybe that... Ch I thought that chest had a snake in it. But apparently I missed the star key somewhere. Is it here? No. Is it here? So anyway, I, I fucking... Um, he kept saying MASSIVE, and every time he said MASSIVE, he put it, like, in all caps. It was really cringy. So I... Oop. I, I made this picture that... It, I didn't put a dick in Richard Garriott's mouth. But I made it look like I did, because I, I, uh, I put, like, a... Like, a blur there that looked like it would be, like, a censored penis, you know? And, uh... <laughs> And I put the word massive on it, which in retrospect, I should have I should have put like a Brazzers logo or something, but uh, All right, ah, this mice always hit and run and You know, it got deleted and then I, I made this ridiculous post Where I you know, I said, you know, oh, it wasn't even real, you know that kind of thing and I kept referring to you know, like Dick Garriott Instead of calling him Richard Garriott, I kept calling him Dick Garriott, and uh, with a with a baby cannon in his mouth, you know. And then I and I gave him instructions like how there was like uh, everyone draw Muhammad Day. It was it was everyone draw Dick Garriott with a with a baby cannon in his mouth day that kind of thing. And <laughs> fucking mice. And I gave, like, detailed instructions for how to do it in Photoshop. And I was even like, okay, like, if you don't have ph Photoshop, steal it from one of your white friends. Trust me, they all have Photoshop, you know. It was a ridiculous post, and I I didn't even get in trouble for it. But the guy got, like, oh, okay, thank you. He got ridiculously angry. Oh, that wasn't the right one. Oh, you've met Richard Garriott? I, I, I mean, I've heard he's a pretty normal person. That was a little rough. Hey, Sherry. If you pick too many mushrooms, you'll be sorry. Oh, yeah, this is the part where you gotta avoid touching his mushrooms. Oh, God, don't get killed. Um. Okay, that, that worked. The good thing is that there's hearts here, and they're only guarded by bats, which are pretty benign enemies. Like, they can hit you, but it doesn't happen too often. I really wanted that gem. You almost thought I was going to get Yeet Wolf. Nah, I just had to wait for the troll to step on the switch. And it opens up. Um. Okay, yeah. Each mushroom that you pick up makes it more dangerous, but you have to... You have to pick some of them up. Shit. Um. I think I can go back and... You never want to touch someone's mushroom. Not without permission. Dude, we gotta make a, uh, now, we gotta make a, uh, okay, I can get through. Oh, I need to make that disappear. Shit. I can see the rune is sitting right there, too. We gotta make an emoji 
for the uh, for the Discord of a wolf saying yeet. Let's see if that did it. I hate this part. Like, I'm pretty sure I could just reset the... <sighs> okay, that helped. Alright, alright, that did it. And I just gotta kill the Reapers now. Alright, you have a good night, Barrel. Ugh! That's one down. Oh god. Alright, maybe I should just grab it. Bah! Why did I try to do that? Alright, this time, start. Oh, but it puts me back there anyway. Alright, that's fine actually. Let me let me go in. Because I have 48, 48 monies, so I can get some armor. There we go. Now, do I have to actually equip that or. No, it's. It, okay, cool. It's already equipped. God, I forgot how tough this game is. Oh, I, I can make it. I mean, all, all the emojis on the uh, Discord I've made, I don't mind doing it. But I was just, like, I was thinking about that already, and I wanted to run that by you and think, ask you if you think it would be funny. And if I get enough sub points on uh, Twitch, I don't need to go that way. To unlock a um, another emote. We can make the Yeet Wolf a sub emote, you know? Alright. It's a dog Yeet dog out there? Oh, Barrel, what the fuck? See, this is what Barrel does. Barrel says, alright, I'm going to bed, I'm gonna head out. And then never leaves. Which is fine. Uh, I don't actually need to go that way. I prefer you stayed, actually. Alright. God, I used to be good at this game, but now I... Not so much. Oh, I don't need to talk to you, Melissa. Alright. Yeah, that, that, that shit's funny. Dog eat dog world. I, that's gotta be one of my favorite clips, though. The Yeet Wolf. It's fucking hilarious. The game actually does get easier because uh, as you get more runes, you get more like health and whatnot. I don't need to go there. All right. Come to think of it, I don't really need to do all of these, do I? Just that one. And um, hold on. Oh yeah, this is the, I mean, my whole existence on that forum was specifically t in that one. Specifically to to annoy people that annoyed AJ. Yeah, I wanted to believe that you came up with that barrel. Oh, that was the wrong one. Okay, that's fine. I can I can dig it. A sweetest shit posting place. I can't think of anything more unappealing than that. Oh, I think I have to hit it twice. Okay. Let's try that again. I was trying to be minimalistic here. I was at the very end, too. Honestly, I like that whole the whole experience that I had in TTLG was very negative. And I was there for ver only a very brief point in time, so I can only imagine how bad it is to to be there for an extended period and fucking hell. Well, I guess I'll grab that anyway. You gonna yeet yourself into bed? Yeet! Maybe I shouldn't have been so forward there. You don't regret all your time in T- I regret all your time on TTLG. Right, there's a timing to the mice. There we go. Alright. Oh god! <laughs> I didn't need to react there. He can't shoot through walls. I 
I mean, just to give you guys an example of how bad it kind of still is, is that AJ was telling me about how um, there's this one asshole there that always goes on about how violent AJ is. And I'm like, well, why does this guy think you're violent? And it's because, like, well, uh, they said something on there, like, all fascists get the bullet. Like, fascists get the bullet. And I'm like, this guy thinks you're violent because you said fascists get the bullet? That's kind of interesting because, like, does that mean they're a fascist? Yeah, Tony Tarantula's the guy, yeah. Oh, AJ's saying the same thing as I'm saying it. My bad on that. The guy's definitely a dipshit. So, like, they even said something like, Oh, I'm afraid you're gonna shoot me, you know, or something like that. And I'm like, well, I, I would have said something like, Well, I only shoot fascists. Wait a minute, are you trying to tell me something? Oh, it's perfectly open now. All right. Are you trying to tell me something? I've never heard somebody with that level of small dick energy other than, like, Ben Shapiro. Because that's what that is. That's fucking small dick energy. I need to kill both of these Reapers. Clearly, if I try to just snag the rune, I'm going to die like I did last time. I got impatient, and that's a bad thing to be in this game. All right. I don't want to accidentally hit those switches because that'll fuck up this whole thing. Eventually we'll get better weapons. There it is. Oh yeah, yeah that's right. He's in the military, but he's worried that you're going to shoot him. You have reclaimed the Rune of Compassion. You have gained dexterity. Oh. Sexy. I can do the uh, counterclockwise twist at the end. Ladies. Uh, yeah, there's a quick way out. All right. All right. Hey, dickhead. All right. Let's go talk to uh, Lord Lord Tittish here. <laughs> By the way, Lord Tittish is another thing that I said to, that that completely went made that guy go ballistic. That was done well. Seek now the cavern of deceit, where all is not as it seems. All right, you didn't actually tell me what it, where it is, but all right. Maybe it's this one. Let's see. Yep, that's it. Cavern of deceit. Okay. Da, 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 da. This game is almost entirely dungeon. Let's talk to Dr. Cat. That's true, Wayne. The exes in this cavern will teleport you back here. That guy, like, I know that I know that of that guy in his posting history, and he, you know, he always claims that he's been in the military, but there's no way that guy's been in the military. Here's Finn. My name is Honest Finn, and I never tell a lie. That's a lie. Basically, anything Finn says, the opposite of that is true. So. Uh. Who's worse, Ben Shapiro, or Jordan Peterson? I mean, like, obviously Peterson's worse, but I feel like Ben Shapiro's entire existence is to try to impress Peterson. All right. Uh-huh. Mushrooms do weird things. What's up? If you want to get the Rune of Honesty, take the south door first. Obviously, we're going to take the north door because this guy's, you know, a lying piece of shit. Oh, yeah, I mean, they're both awful, but the question was who's worse, so. A dungeon clawing was... What? A dungeon clawing was only for this Ultima game and nothing else? What? Chris. You must speak sense. Yeah. Okay. This part's pretty easy. I'm kind of remembering a lot of this, too. Crawling. No, there were other Ultima games that kind of had dungeon crawl. I mean, this is not really a dungeon crawler, though. But it is mostly dungeon. Oh, fuck. All right, I fucked it up. I, I forgot that at the end you have to switch it up. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I can do that. I think this one has a, a bigger proliferation of puzzles 
than any other Ultima game, which was traditionally just talk to a lot of people, gather information. You know, that was what Ultima was all about. This one's more about puzzles. Yeah! Yeah, at the very end, you have to change up the pattern, otherwise you get... Because the X's always bring you back to the room where Dr. Cat is, and that's pretty much a reset. Oh, okay, Chris, I get it now. You're, you're, you're fucking around. I get it. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no. That one. Okay. All right, so here, I gotta make sure I don't fuck this up. Um... There we go. Easy. Oh, he's the doggo! Hello, doggo. The troll can't be hurt, but this lever can help. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so the troll basically control... The, the switch controls the troll's movement, so he's only going up and down. So you can't kill this troll, he's invincible, but what you can do is you can influence him to go to an out-of-the-way spot. Oh! I don't want him to shoot at me. There we go. Wait, wait, one more, one more. All right, he's stuck now. You look like a penguin when facing to the side. Uh, yeah, I see it. I see it. I totally see the penguin. These trolls can be hurt. Oh, yeah. Money! No, it's like Boulder Dash. <laughs> do I want to go there or do I want to go this way? Let me see what Finn says. Pull this lever first or you'll never make it through the swamp. So I definitely don't want to pull that lever. But do I want to go this way? Oh, no, it's a mouse. All right. All right. Definitely don't want to pull that. I think he makes things shoot at you. Boulder Dash is like Boulder Dash. That's real. Basically, anything Finn says, do the opposite. And you'll be fine. Yar! Hi there. Be careful to stay on the paths. Okay, yeah. Uh, 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 I believe, like, if you go off the path, it basically... Oh, fuck. Everything fucking explodes. Ah, uh, we made it. Okay. That looked fun! Could you go back and do it again? Screw you. Sherry really needs to get a bathroom. Get to a bathroom. Oh, yeah, she's she's doing the shit dance. Like, I gotta shit, I gotta shit, I gotta shit. Move! Get out of my way! I gotta go to the bathroom! I gotta poop, I gotta poop, I gotta poop, I gotta poop! That's a real song, by the way. Uh, let's see. Okay, can't go that way. Hey, AJ, did you specifically troll Jordan Peterson on, uh on Twitter once, like, rather successfully. Now you have to look it up. I don't know who does it, but there's a, there's a song that goes like that. It's a heavy metal song. I saw it in, like, a meme compilation thing once. Yeah, there's the rune. That was a quick one, huh? By the way, the music freezing like that, the actual Game Boy game does do that, so it's, it's not... Because I'm playing on an emulator. Oh shit. You, you, I gotta go pee by diarrhea of <laughs> You have reclaimed the root of honesty. You have gained intelligence. See, now I have a little bit more magic than I did before. This will take me back here and... Screw you, sir. Alright. Screw you, sir. Let's see what Lord Tittish has to say. On Verity Isle to the east... You must seek the Rune of Valor. I feel like before I go fucking around with that, I should probably, like, uh, grind up enough money to get that bow, which is 60. Uh, I think the best way to get money is to just continually come in here and grab the money that randomly appears on the floor. I think that chest might have money in it, too. Yeah. That's a heart. Okay. But there's always at least one gold that appears randomly on this floor somewhere. Oh, I'm not seeing it now. Go figure. Make a liar out of me. Diarrhea of madman. 
I might actually have to go into the castle to make it reset. Oh, yeah, there's one. I think that's what it is. You have to go in the castle to reset the money. Sargon does a pretty good job of trolling himself, I think. Like, that guy's a real fucking piece of shit. And I side-eye anyone who follows him. I really do. Alright, once again, I'm not seeing any money. Sargon's tough to troll as the asshole followers bombard you. You got threatened by a few... Yeah, but, like... They're ineffectual weenies, aren't they, Wayne? Or, like, were there any, like, threats that were actually credible? Oh. Have you ever played Lone Survivor? No. As a matter of fact, I'll be honest, I the, the, the name sounds, like, very vaguely familiar to me, but I'm not even sure I know what type of game that is. Yeah, I may have an army of keyboard warriors and tough guys, but that's all they are. There's got to be a better way to do this. Hold on, let's see. I mean, there's gems there. All I got to do is do the Lady of the Tiger scenario, and that doesn't take that long to get to. 2D Silent Hilly. Well, I'm not a fan of Silent Hill, but I would I would definitely look at the game, you know, to see if I was interested. And okay, yeah, I'll just do that each time. We only need uh 60 gold. One survivor's lit. Should I look it up? And you know what? Let's 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 uh let me quick, real quick. Let me just because I'll be able to tell very fast if it's something that I would like be interested in or not, and if it is, I'll the wish list it. Although I feel like I already have like so many fucking things on my wish list. That it's like, God, I just, you know, wish I had fucking money. I could barely pay my own bills. And, you know, <laughs> let's see here. Um, what'd you say? Lone Survivor. Lone Survivor, the director's cut. Wait a minute, hold on. What did that say? Um, guess what? I have it. <laughs> I must have gotten it in a bundle. I don't remember buying it, or did somebody buy it for me? I must have gotten that in a fucking bundle. Or either that, or it, I thought it looked cool and I bought it and I forgot about it. I, I fucking have the game already. I wonder if it sounded familiar. Hold on. Uh... Nope, somebody bought it for me. AJ! AJ, back when your Steam name was Guy Gardner, you got me Lone Survivor with the message, Dear VMX, hey stumpfucker, I hope you fucking enjoy these goddamn games, you wank weasel. Merry goddamn Christmas, bro. There you go. I have it. <laughs> I've never played it, but I do have it. Like, no wonder it sounds familiar. It's in my fucking Steam library. So I'm like, I don't even know, I honestly, I don't even know what type of game it is, but. <laughs> the messages that me and AJ send back and forth to each other when we do get each other games is, is amazing. AJ, do you have any of the messages that I've sent you saved? You don't even know what's wrong with us? What's right with us? Let's be real here, I mean. Let's ask the real questions. What's right with us? Sorry you guys are watching me grind for money here, but... Yeah, we like, literally, we've known each other for two decades, so... And... We've been through so many different things and different stages of our lives, and it's just, you know... And, and, and now you're... Like, come on, like, you are not exempt from the weirdness. You're, you're on the same level as us. Just in your own way. I literally only need one more piece of money, so I'm not going to go through all that shit. So I want to buy that bow. I know it's not in here, but sometimes these guys drop money, so I figured I'd try that. How, how long was the time difference between that and the way we met? What? Oh. But you gotta, you gotta see if you can dig up, like, 
because uh, like I know I haven't gotten a game in a while because I haven't fucking had money in a while, but I used to get you games all the time. See if you can find like any of the messages that I've sent. There we go. All right, we have enough for the bow now. Did you ever follow Ego Raptor? No, I, I, I honestly, no. I don't even know really know who that is other than that I've heard the name before. You'd be surprised how few like um. No, no. <sighs> Damn it. That's what I want to do. Okay. How few like um. Big name YouTubers I actually follow. Bah. All right, so we got to go east. Wait, what? Which one? Just so. I Jesus Christ, my phone's going insane. Just so I make sure I get this right. Because there might be more than one cavern there. Oh, it's just Pokemon Rumble Rush. Let me no, let me go here and see which which what it was called. Uh, oh, he doesn't say. It just says Rune of Valor. So it's probably like Cowardice or whatever. Is it east? Go east. Go east, young man. Da 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 da. God, look how jank the game is, though. But it's it's such a fun game. Well, I don't need. Oh God. I don't know who Dorkly. I don't. I don't know who Schmork, Schmorky is. I know Dorkly. I follow Dorkly because that shit's fucking hilarious. Why am I even finding the fucking squid? There we go. What is this like the Lyceum or some shit? Oh, it is the Lyceum. Wow. Holy shit! I did it. Welcome to the Lyceum. Beware of the gremlins in the Cavern of Cowardice. They will steal your food. I don't even know who Schmorky is. It's, it's a ridiculous name. Uh, why would you name yourself Schmorky? You should come visit my shop, the Cat's Lair. I guess I will. Isn't he a silly kitty? Yeah, yeah, he's a bitch. He's a, he's a big bitch. Oh, okay, all right. Uh, I can, oh, fucking hitting wrong buttons. Go ahead. There we go. Um, is there a point to this? Oh, there is, okay. Rubber ninja. Y'all talking about some shit, I don't even know. Money! I don't think there's any other point to this, so I'm just gonna leave. Well, they seem seen better days. Is this it? Cabin of Cowardice! Oh yeah, he's not gonna stop looking like a penguin. Be better if he looked like a goose, though. Ah, 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 ah. A goose walked up to a lemonade stand, and he said to the man, run in the stand, ah, 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 and then he died. The guy, not the goose. Go back while you still can. Nah, I'm good. Okay, what's this say? This is a dead end. No shit. This fucking game, yo. This is a dead end. Choose your path carefully. He's the poor guy whose wife swept with poor pro Jared. I sympathize with anybody who even knows pro jared like even knows of them and i know of pro jared and i feel bad for myself i do see there's a mouse all right what do we got here this is a dead end i'm so glad you told me i was going to continue walking right through the wall below you will meet your doom danger keep out yeah watch this shit uh-huh oh Actually, that was bad. All right, I should not have done that. All right, we got ghosts. All right, come on, come on at me, come on at me, ghosty boy. What you you ain't shit. You can be dead again, bitch. There's a reaper, a bat. All right, hold on. I didn't really need that. I'm gonna fuck this bat up. All right, aha. It's gonna take a lot less shots with this bow, at least. The Reapers are still tough, but... Typically, you don't run into Reapers till near the end of a Ultima game, you know? Uh, can't do much there. Can't... Oh, actually, I can do that. <sighs> Keep digging, Watson! I don't think I wanna fuck with those mushrooms. I'm just gonna go here. Oh god, Will-O-Wisps. I really don't like them. Gotcha, bitch. Damn, died ass. Oh, God. Ah. Need this goddamn rifle unloaded in ya. Looks like a 
pink cushion. Yeah, guys, ever hear that that uh, the the prank call that I'm referencing right now? Oh god! First, she thought the Reapers were instant death. No, nah, they just they they do a lot of damage. And if you go down a hole, you won't be able to climb back up. You've never heard it? Oh my god. Uh, well, it's not like I can go down that hole. Or I can go through here. It was from the Howard Stern has some food. Hopefully our gremlin doesn't show up to steal it right away. It was from the uh, the Howard Stern show, and the joke was that um, they called up this like random ass old lady, and she was like a hardcore like hillbilly, you know. And they used clips of Blue Iris, who was a geriatric porn star, and she had a like a radio show on Howard's channel. And uh, uh, do I want the upper one or the lower one? I'm gonna try the lower one. And the lady, and it was just like a bunch of cock talk, you know. The lady reacted very badly to Blue Iris saying all these sexually charged things to her. And uh, threatened her repeatedly with every weapon you can think of. Like, if you can think of a weapon, she had it. She had like a 38, a rifle, a shotgun, a handgun. She's going to chop her head off and throw her in the... Do you guys want to hear it? Because I'll play it for if you want to hear it. Do you need the key? Here it is. Yeah, I do need that. But which door do I go in? Because I only you know, you're giving me one. Let's go in. No, wait, hold on. Which key did you give me? Oh, an Ankh key. Oh, oh, they're all different. Okay, so I have to go here. Yeah. Okay. All right. There's the star key. All right. That just made rats appear. If you guys want to hear the, it's it's one of the funniest fucking. Um, prank calls ever made. If you want to hear it, I'll play it for you. I don't really need that. All right. Don't need a heart key because... Oh, God. You're see-through on the rug? What, Moogle? What? What are you even saying? Ah, it's just a ghost. All right, um, the sprite? Yeah, yeah the sprites see through anywhere, to be honest. Oh, here, here's the Black Knight, check it out. If I could get out of here. <laughs> but you can't. Uh, I don't know if I need to hit that switch, but all right, some food. All right, oh God. Haha. <laughs> Do it. You want to hear it, guys? All right. Let me let me finish this dungeon and then I'll play you that. It, it's honestly like one of the funniest things I've ever heard. All right, grab that. I don't think there's much left to this place. There's a rope there. Yeah. I mean, nobody ever said this game was very polished. It's only a flesh wound. It's funny how the ghosts can go through walls, but they can't go over water. Ooh, he left money. I have to grab that. See, like, they can come through the wall, but they can't come through the fucking water. Bitch ghosts. Ghosts ain't shit. The X will take you back to the room you came from, but get the magic rope first. Alright, yeah. The rope will let you make a bridge for one star, but riddle me this. Why is a raven like a writing desk? Alright. Uh, I think I need to grab this first, though. Yeah. So the rope is like a basically a magic artifact that lets you make a bridge over water for the cost of one magic point, which are the stars on the right side of the screen. Let me go here. Okay. Uh, so what we got to do is, you know what? I'm going to pause it here actually. And I'm going to right now, I'm going to, I'm going to play you that, that prank call. Let's see if I can find it's it's so funny. I'm not gonna stop the game audio because it's a whole fucking thing, but I'm gonna play it for you. Cause I'm gonna continue playing the game once it, as we go through it. Um 
Oh, shit. Why can't I find it? Oh, I think this is it. Here's Blue Iris and a phony phone call. I know you like Let me know if you guys can hear that. She calls some old lady. Oh, yes. It's pretty it's pretty gross. Do you guys know of any bills for you? Hello? Hi. Hi. How are you? Right. Fine, how are you? I'm wearing a Nego J. Huh? Are I you? stoked through my depends. What? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm oh god. Nervous. Am I making you hot? <laughs> what? I love a black cock. You go to hell, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Hello? I'm massaging my breasts. What? Why don't you fuck me? I fucked you with a shotgun. Oh, this is making you so hot. The bluebirds are building your ass before you get back to earth. You son of a bitch, and don't you call my goddamn number no more. Oh my god. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Hello? Can I put my finger in your ass? Can I put a 38 in your ass, you son of a bitch? Yeah. Yeah. I this goddamn rifle unloaded in you. You didn't call nobody to talk like that, you nasty mouth son of a bitch. Are you stroking your cock? No, I want to stroke yours. I'm going to take you down the creek and chop your goddamn head off of my machete and throw you in the creek, you son of a bitch, and throw your ass. Head at your damn dying ass, you nasty mouth, you old, ugly, ignorant thing. I suck on your tits. <laughs> got down 22 in you. You'd be a pretty looking son of a bitch. Look like a pin cushion. God, God. Are you crazy, son of a bitch? Nasty mouth, bastard. Well, there you go. All right, let me let me turn that off. They actually went up playing it again because they were laughing so hard the first time. They're like, "We got to play that again." Uh, oh god! All right, it's getting a little intense. I do have food that I could use. Let me just yeah, burn through one of those. Let me kill these just in case they get released at any point. <coughs> I'll send it. Nobody's talking. Ah, yep. Yeah. Horror. Do I need to do this? Okay. Oh, they made all the water disappear. Alright. Uh, yeah, this way maybe? I don't fucking know. Pinor. Yeah. Like I said, there's a whole lot of cock talk. Alright, this is gonna- I'm gonna get hit there no matter what, so... I don't know if there's a way to do that without getting hit. But did you guys hear, like, how many different weapons- oh, there's the rune. This lady said that she was gonna use... Ah, idiot. There we go. We got it! Need this goddamn rifle unloaded. I I'll fuck you with a shotgun! You have reclaimed the Runabala. You have gained strength. And I believe that that woman has every single one of those weapons that she says she has. Including, I think she even said machete at some point. Like, I fully believe she has all those weapons. Let's see what this is all about. Oh, it's a shot. Welcome to the Cat's Lair. You can use cheese to lure monsters out of your way. Alright, so they have magic, food, cheese. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. Oh, well. All right, let's go back to Lord Titish. Pinor. Eh, eh. Ow. I was hoping to sneak by that guy. Stupid squid. You go squish now. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. All right. Here I go. What's up? Hast thou found... As thou a wand of fireballs, thou must sail west to seek the rune of justice. Alright, well, I don't have a wand of fireballs, though. Huh. Was I supposed to... Yeah, because I can't get there without the wand of fire... Did I miss that? You have a cat attempting to sneak into your lap? Oh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, we can do this. Uh-huh, uh-huh. 
That'll bring me down here. I don't know if I need to go down here, but... I don't know where the Wand of Fireballs actually is. Alright. Let me kill the fucking squid. God, they got a lot of fucking health. And they got better armor there for 50. They got a crossbow. Crossbow, I believe, it, it doesn't shoot as fast as the regular bow. But I think it's like more powerful. Let's see. Umbogo sano. Otomo make good weapons. Good armor. You buy. Then go. Then Otomo go buy pineapple. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, cats and dogs version of being sneaky is just doing the same thing they're normally doing. Just very slowly. Is there anything like hidden around here? I remember I found a dev room in this game once. Oh, right, free heart. All right, Let's go here maybe. What is this, Empath Abbey or something? A tunnel beneath the sea leads to the Isle of the Avatar. Thank you, Johan. Until Lord Simon returns, I am king of this castle. <laughs> king of shit, motherfucker. Oh, let's not do that. Release the Kraken. Yeah, the fact that I don't have a Wander Fireballs is slightly worrisome. Oh, God. What's that? Cavern... No, 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 Let's not do that just yet. Oh, look, the Black Knight's here. You'll never find the one weapon that can defeat me. Yes, I will. <laughs> you need a space there, Chris. Ah. Um... I don't really remember, to be honest, Moogle. It's been a long time. He, I mean, he's basically telling me, like, yo, you need the fucking Wonder Fireballs. And I didn't pick it up. So I don't know if it was supposed to be in that last dungeon and I just missed it at some point. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. I know. I know, I know, I know where it might be. You can hear the Gibzo, huh? This is the time of night that Gibbs has started to, like, go a little ape shit. With his uh, anxiety. I'm hoping that it's getting better. I have an idea. I don't know if it's like a correct idea, but... I think I know what I need to do. You fucking piece of shit. No. I'll take the money though. Pretty sure he stole the- yeah, he stole the piece of food I had. Um... Okay. Goddamn bats! Can't stop here, it's bat country! Ah, uh, now I'm not so sure. Can somebody, like, look up where the Wand of Fireballs is? It might not even be in this dungeon. Fuck it. Does the game have the bird bee bat? What are you talking about, Moogle? I'll do it, Chris. You gotta do... Hold on. Okay, I did it, Chris. Why? What? Uh, let me ask you a question, though. Why are you now wanting to unban this person? Everything is confusing today. Yeah, I don't think it's this dungeon, actually. It is what? I'm gonna look it up real quick, because I, I, I forget where the Wand of Fireballs actually is, and clearly I need it. Let's see. Ultima, Runes of Virtue, Wand of Fireballs. Because I, I can't get it without, like, uh, I can't get to the next dungeon without getting the Wand of Fireballs. Oh, fucking really? Stupid Will-O-Wisp. Sorry about that. I was not looking at the window. Alright. It says it's in deceit. 
Yeah. It okay. That's I, I I know I I know exactly where it is. It's just I was confused as to which dungeon. It's not this one. The bird bee bat. Well, I mean, technically, it would be the bird bee bat skeleton guy. I don't know. Because there's always skeletons in every game, too. Piece of shit. Gremlin. Come back here, you fuck. Oh, you're a dead man now. Because you talked it out. So what was the deal? Like, are you going to tell me, like, what... I'm glad you talked it out, but, like, what's actually going on? Oh, I should have done that. Because, like, you... You know, this person's coming at you pretty hard, and... It didn't sound like you really did anything wrong. Um... I may have kind of fucked myself here, so we're going to have to do this at the... It's like those little assholes that drop the potions in Golden Axe. Yeah, it is. It's just typical video game gremlins. Oh. Yeah, I think I've... I've fucked this up. Let me just do like this. You'll tell me on DM? Alright, cool. But everything's still the way... Wait, hold on. Oh, that's just, all that did was make enemies appear. I mean, you could tell me on DM now, like, you could type it up now and I'll look at it later. Wait, I know, I just remembered I could use this Ankh to go back. I'm an idiot. Alright, so I gotta go to Deceit. Which is this one? Yes, okay. So I'm stupid, like, I forgot. Basically, when you come here... And Finn tells you, if you want to get the rune of honesty, you take the south door. Obviously, he's lying, but you take the south door to get the wand of fireballs. So I should have come back to do that, and I forgot about it. Where does this bring me? Uh huh. Oh, okay, that's bull blood's bullshit. We're hanging and slashing the unholy things. It's true. We really are. This treasure chest is safe, but look out for the gem up north. It's a trap. That means that this one's a trap, and the gem up north is perfectly safe. I want the gem. See? Look, not a trap. Finn, you piece of shit. Man, fuck that guy. Am I ever going to raid randos again? I might. But why? I I would rather not because I have friends to raid. You know what I mean? Like I I'd rather just have like a large group of people that I follow who I can raid if need to be. It's not worth fighting the slimes. A hammer will let you smash one barrel. Choose carefully. And there's a hammer. Okay. I mean, like I honestly, you know, obviously you guys know I had a really bad experience raiding a random person. Fucking piece of shit, rat. Get back here. Alright, this is obviously the one you want to smash, so I'll just do that. Trolls out! Trolls only! Keep out! Oh, it's 4chan. Alright. No fishing, no boating, no swimming. No diving. No fun. Adventurers, go home. Trolls ahead. Turn back now. We mean it. You'll be sorry. It's still not too late to go back. Now it is. You are warned. Well, I need the Wand of Fireballs to continue the game, so... Uh, let, me, let me talk to him. If you go through this doorway, you can get lots of treasure. I'm not going through that doorway, then. Well, I need a star key to get the heart key. Uh, all right, 
Let's see, does this do anything good? I don't know what it did. There's a star key, all right. Because they're trolls, you ban trolls. Come on, man, get with it. That was an obvious joke. There's the Ankh key. I don't know what these much. Oh, they're making enemies appear. I don't really mind if there's enemies. Makes the game exciting. I think I might have to hit all the mushrooms, though. Hmm, making treasures appear as well. Shit! Hmm. Talk to Sherry. There's no way out of here. You'd better use your onk to go home. Uh, but I want the Wand of Fireballs. I don't know what that does. The Wand of Fireballs is around here somewhere. Yeah, I'm looking for it. Brutal Doom, ugh. ugh. That's a big negative buenas. Ah, there's the Wand of Fireballs, alright. Fun fact, enemies can't hit you when you're standing on a wall like that. Alright, well. Alright, we got the wand. And let's use the Ankh to get out of here. Alright, so yeah, 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 I know where to go. Alright. I honestly can't condone the playing of Brutal Doom. Alright, so let me use that. Hey, hey, okay. Wait, does the Wand of Fireballs use up magic? Let me just shoot it a few times and see. It doesn't seem to actually use up magic. It might be better than the bow, I don't know. I don't want to fuck with the seahorses. Oh, okay, it does use it magic. It just takes a long time. All right, cool. Let's see if there's any points of interest. Uh, this might be... I don't know what this might be. Oh, oh, this is Empath Abbey. That means that other castle must have been Serpent's Hold. Welcome to Empath Abbey. Look for the boomerang in the Cavern of Injustice. Boomerang? What is this, fucking Zelda? Did you know that slimes will divide when you hit them? Yes, I did know that, actually. Hey, what's up, dude? There's pirate treasure in the Cavern of Injustice. X marks the spot. I just came here to take a nap. Pfft, that's real. That's all anybody ever wants, right? Just a fucking good few hours sleep. Oh, there's a sign over there. Let me see if I can get my way over there. The Wishing Well. I wish, I wish, I was a fish. Oh, this is the dev room, I think. It might be, I don't know. Yes, it is. Like the game, write Dr. Cad and Gary at P.O. Box. And there's an address there. And tell us what you think. So this is legit the dev room. To enter the secret contest, send your name and address and a postcard to Dr. Cat. Once a month, he'll pick a card and send out an origami dragon. Dude, I wonder if, like, that's still a thing. Like, imagine if Dr. Cat still fucking works at, like, like EA or whatever, whoever bought out this company. And, like, a, like, you send it now. You know, your name and address and a postcard ask for fucking origami dragon. You're, like, the only motherfucker who's doing it in 2019. I forget what that item does. I don't even know what that is. I just grabbed it, though. I used to wear a bear suit to work every day. Ogle, it's one of your people. Eep, eep, eep. I am a seahorse. Mogul, it's another one of your people. Hi, Gibbsy. Okay, could you not lick my elbows? Thank you. Four shades of off green? Oh, no. Get off my gifts. I believe that guy was an illustrator. While programming, I listen to the music of giants. I'm sure you do. I collect stuffed animals, board games, and dragons. Nerd! Alright, that's the dev room. Mm -mm. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, 
Oh wait, let me go over there. I just realized I have enough money for that better armor. Okay, so there's caltrops, fire bombs, an axe. Bonjour, my friend. Are you coming to the Cavern of Injustice? Be careful not to step in the lava. Yeah, I'll try not to step in the goddamn lava. I can grab these that just change the way the place looks. It's so stupid, but... Yeah, I just realized I actually have enough money for that better armor, and before I go to the next dungeon, I should probably get down on some of that better armor. Yeah, I kind of figure he might have meant they might be giants. What, what, uh, yeah. We, we know you like plushies. We know. Trust me. What does this item do? Let me see. Whatever it does, I just used it up. I have no idea what that is. I completely have forgotten what that item is supposed to be. It looks like a horn or something. Oh, it freezes enemies. Okay. I just noticed that the enemy, the bat wasn't moving around. Yeah, that's actually really useful on like uh, dragons and shit later on. But you can get more of those. Alright. I believe this store sold... The uh, chain mail or whatever it was. Or maybe not. Okay, no, you sell a bunch of bullshit that I don't need. Maybe it was in the southern island? I'm gonna go look there. That's right, bitch. Da, 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 Obviously, we're not gonna, like, beat this tonight. I'll have to, like, do another stream of it one day. Maybe next Saturday? Who no Sunday, rather? Who knows? Who knows? Schedule's kind of a little bit more open than it was. I need the rope for that. The music is so very Ultima, though. Like, you hear this and it's like, yeah, that's what fucking Ultima sounds like. I ain't fucking with the slime, though. There it is. There's chainmail here. Okay. And that should... That's automatically equipped. Cool. Alright. Nice. Would I redo Final Fantasy Adventure? Actually, yes. I am planning on doing that. Because I'd like to do, like, the Mana series. But, like, So, like, I would start with Final Fantasy Adventure and then go on to, like, Secret of Mana and Trials of Mana. Not that I'd be able to play, like, the Switch version of Trials of Mana or the remake, but I'll just play, like, the Super Famicom version. Alright, so we're going this way. I'm kind of using up a lot of magic moving around, but whatever. We'll, we'll pick up more magic somewhere. That doesn't sound like an Atari game. What Atari games do you know sound like this? Come on. Not like a Game Boy game to me. That's right, bitch. All right. Injustice. This is where we need to be, right? Yeah. Love the animation of the penguin walking into the hole. You have 15 seconds to find two keys and move on. Better hurry. All right, or shit starts exploding, right? There's a key. Uh, I want that, though. Uh, out of my way. That's a key. All right. Go, 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 go. I made it. Trials of Mana is a really great game. I played it briefly when... Okay, is the money broken? The money's broken. Why can I not get money? I mean, that's like real life, but... Yo, what the fuck? I'm gonna go talk to that guy. Oh, I don't really want to mess with these slimes. Get away from me. Oh man, I'm gonna have to kill the slimes, aren't I? Alright. <sighs> Shit. You just have to keep killing them, and they'll eventually stop. Slimes look like the Pineco. Pineco! They don't look like Pineco. Yeah, this is terrible. Let me just fucking take the damage and talk to this. All the coins down here are fool. Oh, they're fool's gold, that's why. I just came to look for my dog, Kadar. He knows how to get through the minefield. Go, go, go! Fuck. They're fool's gold, that's why. Alright. No, fool's hearts? Well, that was worth it. No, I have one coin. It was a, they were fool's gold. Did you know that monsters never carry fool's gold? That's good. Because they, they're... Apparently the monsters are not idiots. I forgot completely about the whole fool's gold thing. 
I'm back there, okay. I am the slime coming out of your TV set. I know the pan pipes are down here somewhere. All the monsters will stop to listen when they hear it. Fuck! That is irritating. I don't think there's a way to get those gems. Doesn't look like it's in the cards. Oh, fuck. Lava. Alright. Alright, that one didn't explode. You a bitch. Alright. Nothing about a bunch of wood and nickels. Okay. Oh! I'm an idiot. Fucking really? There we go. Little girl, what the hell are you doing in a monster infested cave? Well, she's related to one of the developers, obviously. Oh god, no! Piece of shit. Uh, look, it spells out Dr. Cat. Did a dragon steal all your town's money? That must be it. Going this way. Oh, the fool's gold actually lowers your fucking money. No wonder. I'm glad I spent, like, the majority of my money before I got here. There's will-o'-wisps here. I'm just going for it. Alright, there we go. I should not have done that. Alright, so I'll lose a bunch of money to get food, which I'm going to use immediately. Alright. Ah, fucking... The gems are always real, but obviously you can't get that one. Well, shit. Nah, fam. Alright, we're good, we're good. Told y'all, this game's fun. Ah! That's right, bitch. Move, bitch. Get out the way. Take that, you rat bastard. That's real. I'd really like to not deal with this slime, so if we can just get it to... That's for food. All right. Oh, wait, actually, I want that heart. Even if it explodes. All right. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. Yep. Oh, it's a mimic! Bitch. Bitch-ass mimic. Oh. Right, so it says a hammer behind a heart door. But it didn't have fool's gold. Yeah. yeah, monsters never carry fool's gold. I think he took my... Nope, I still have the food. Alright. So now we have a hammer. If I had a hammer... Bitch. Ah! Did I keep it? No, I didn't. Okay. I have a feeling that's gotta be a mimic. Let's find out. Yeah. Yeah, that was a mimic. This should have been the deceit because of all the fool's gold. Come on. What you got, Harry Potter? Let's do this. Bitch. Heart key. If I had a hammer, I'd hammer all these fucking nails. <laughs> that's real. That's, that's super real. Uh, I don't know if I actually want to use a heart key on one of those rooms, but I feel like that's like my only option. Or should I? I only have one. Let me let me go back here. I think there might have been something here to use a heart key on. Or no, I already opened that. All right. 
Yeah, this should have been the cave of deceit, not injustice. The injustice is that they didn't do it right. They're not real treasure chests. I can't even, like... Aw, oh, man. Now what? Oh, wait, just go this way. Fuck it. Look at that. That's gotta be a mimic. Ooh, got through him without getting hit. Ah, oh, didn't do that time. No, Justice is on Mondays. That's for real. I don't know if I want to risk that. All right, I'll take that. Shit. Hmm. Fuck you. Okay. Da -da -da. I'm gonna have to figure this shit out. Let's see. Heart key. Okay. Hammer. Okay, cool. I needed a hammer. So basically, I gotta break this with a hammer. Look at all this stuff you can't get. Fuck. No! I tried to move out of the way. You see how much damage them motherfuckers do? Let's go back in and do it. Telefragged. Now I know not to try and pick up the damn wooden nickels. I was pretty far in too when that happened. That's true though, injustice is on Mondays. Ah! I kinda went a different way. Oh god, the e beeps. You wanna stay the fuck away from them. They just multiply when you touch them and it's like a whole fucking thing. I went a completely different way this time. I don't know if that matters. Wait a minute. <laughs> well, shit. <laughs> her mods thought you were stalking her? Uh, well, to be honest, I can see where they came from, but obviously you weren't, but... I mean, but did Cheese think that? Yeah, I should have just went the same way that I went the first time, because that was clearly the right way. I was trying to, like, speed run. Get out of my way. Move, rat! Get out the way! Get out the way, rat! Get up! Get out the way! No, 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 leave me alone. Okay. Not at first, but other people were concerned. Because you do spend, like, a lot of time at her streams. It's not necessarily a bad thing, but... I can see how, like, people would get concerned. Like, oh, what the fuck hit me there? That was bullshit. Oh, it was the trap that that guy keeps pushing. All right. All right, here's the Dr. Cat room. Bitch. Whatever, I don't care. Oh, it's a fucking wooden nickel. I know it's fool's gold, but y'all got me calling it wooden nickels now. <laughs> Just go. It's been, yeah, I mean... But I do see you in her streams, like, a lot. Like, I'll be on Twitch, and I can see what you're seeing, and it's like, oh, uh, Chris is at Cheeseball stream. And I'm like, wow, Chris is really enjoying her content. But, like, you know, and this is not a bad thing, but you prefer the ladies, and sometimes you can be a little flirty. And, man, fuck that guy. Not necessarily anything wrong with it. 
As long as you're a gentleman about it, and fuck, I took my hand off the controller. But yeah, now I can see how people would be concerned, and I'm glad you, you got it all worked out and shit. But like I said, just please don't... Like, if you, if you want to, like, ban somebody from my channel without... Like, not somebody that I know, let me know about it and, like, the reasons why, so that I can, like, be, at least be informed of why that's happening. Alright, I need to... Oh, actually, I'm gonna use that right... I'm gonna use it before he can steal it. You can steal money, that's fine. Because, like, honestly, like, especially that that person wasn't even here, so it's like... Like, how would they even know that they're banned on my channel and, like... It, I mean, it just... it's weird, you know? Did I get to keep it? No, I didn't. Shit. Uh, uh, just go this way. Well, fuck. Double fuck. Horse fritters. Like I said, I got preemptively banned from some asshole's Twitch, and I had no intention of ever going to his Twitch, you know what I mean? And that's only because I mixed it up with the fucker on Twitter. Alright, this is about where I was last time. Yeah, I was trying to fuck that guy up. I don't know why I even bothered. Although, I would like to grab one of these. Like, if you can avoid fighting a Reaper... Alright, there's a hammer there. Okay. Actually, yeah, it's this one. All right. Uh, do I want to fuck with that? Or do I want to go... Oh, God. It is the Twitter guy, yeah. Fucking... Wait, am I in the same place as before? Get back here, you son of a bitch. You stupid gremlin. Got you now. So wait, I guess I'll just go here? I should have left that one there. Uh, there's the rune, okay. Look at all this actual money, all right. How am I gonna get over there? Fucking cock, all right. There we go, 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 go. Eep, eep, eep. That might have done what I needed it to do. I'll stop here, guys. Can't believe that happened. All right, I was right there too, but that those slimes, it, it really is better to just run through them than to try to mix it up with them and oh God. All right, let me like pause it here. So I'm gonna make a save, uh, cause I, I, I feel like I should come back to this cause it's such a fucking fun game and, I, and I'm and i feeling like, like all the nostalgia. So I just made a save state. So anyway, uh, let me go over the schedule, and then we're going to do a raid. So let me uh, put up the raid screen here. We can turn the game off now, actually. And uh, let's see. Let me let, First, let's, let's figure out who we're going to raid today, because I think it's just about that time. I love how this dipshit looks like Dick Air has <laughs> looked for 40 years. <laughs> okay, so we got... Hmm. All right, I'm going to give you guys... The categories and you tell me um what you what you'd like to go to all right so not going to tell you who's streaming why and if you happen to know don't say so so let's see where are we going to send you we can do uh we got a just chatting stream we got a just dance 2019 stream we got a dead by daylight stream iron maiden not iron man but ion maiden spyro reignited trilogy or Rocket League. Those are the options.
What do you guys think? And while you guys are figuring that out, I'm going to go over the schedule. Uh, so, join me tomorrow at 1 p.m. for some uh, Injustice. Injustice 2, to be exact, as we said. Um, hold on, I'm on the wrong thing here. Uh, join me Tuesday at 8 p.m. We're going to be starting Undertale. Wednesday at 1 p.m. We're going to be continuing Dragon Quest 11. Thursday at 8 p.m. We're going to be continuing, hopefully finishing Star Tropics. We'll see how that goes. Friday at 2 p.m. We're going to continue more Dragon Quest 11. And then Saturday at 8 p.m. We're going to finish Castlevania Symphony of the Night. All right. So it looks like most of you guys are going for Spyro, which means we're going to be we're going to be raiding T Sparkle. So we're going to head over to T-Sparkle's channel. As you guys know, if you are a subscriber to the channel, go ahead and use those emojis that you have. Raid oof 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 with the Gibsy Noodle. Raid honk 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 with the uh, the honk honk honkity honk honk. The goose. And uh, we got to make a yeet wolf at some point as an emoji. We'll, we'll do it for... for uh, for your uh, Discord first. Hi, Gibbs. Yes, I said your name was a good boy. So we're going we're gonna to raid T-Sparkle99. And if you're not a subscriber, I keep in mind that it is half off right now. It does not cost a lot to support me. It's $2.50. And if you think about it, what is happening? Oh, hey, Gray. Uh, that's you, Mega Gray, from YouTube, right? Well, thank you for the... Uh, we're just about to end it and, uh, and, and head on over to somebody else's channel. But thanks for the follow and come along with me because we're raiding a good friend of mine. Uh, so we're going to raid T-Sparkle, like I said. And if you are not... It doesn't cost a lot. It did take you long enough. Hey, great. But we're, we're, we're actually just ending now. And we're going to raid somebody. Gibbs, get off of me, dude. So like I said, it, it's $2.50 for a subscription right now. You get cool emojis and you get to support me. Really helps me out. Um, really consider it. And, you know, every other month, it's only fucking $5. Like, you guys, you have $5, right? But anyway, we're going to head over there. I'll see you guys at T-Sparkle Stream. I'll see make a lot of noise as you come and really support him because he's a great kid. Um, I'll see you guys on Discord. I'll see you guys tomorrow from Injustice.